Alright, hello everyone. I'm I've made a new little tiny mod. It's pretty stupid. Uh but it's you know worth showing off, whatever. So we need just a testing ship. Uh we need two orange. We need mainsail and some power. Alright, here we go. So basically what this mod does is... Well, you know what? You'll see in a second. Here we are. So it changes the way the throttle works. It's um, a pulse width modulated throttle. And yeah, it has frequency settings as well. I think it goes up to 20 hertz, I made it. Yeah. I'll set it back down to the default of 5. Get to space by pulsing your engines. <laughs> oh, this is stupid. It's also very annoying, but anyway. <laughs> uh, KSP. This is ridiculous. Oh well, I, I think I mentioned it in KSP Modders like ages ago, and just as a joke I thought, you know what, I'm finally going to make it. I'm going to have my fun too. I don't know if I like 5 hertz, I might go up to 10. That sounds better. Yeah, what it does is it constantly, um, changes the thrust between 0 and 100% and that that's just a GUI glitching out kind of between there KSP must take an average On 100% throttle, it, it does still work the same, because 100% of the time dedicated to the on time is still 100%. Same thing with 0 and 0. It's only the values in between that change. Okay. So let's just go up to our periaps. I'm actually testing this on purpose, because I know this has around 5 kilometers of delta V, so it's enough to uh, get into orbit as an SSTO. It's also really, really, really simple to build. Uh, where are we? Yep, we're at warping altitude. And there you have it. Rocket SSTOs with pulse width modulation. <laughs> 